guys welcome back to another video today i'm going to be doing a well productive vlog i have quite a bit of things to do today today is monday so it's going to be a very productive monday it is around 9 30 right now i did try my best to sleep in this morning so i think i slept in but i did go to sleep pretty late i think i went to bed at 12 30 um i actually got a tattoo yesterday i'll show you guys like a better shot of it later but I don't know if you guys can see if it's focusing but i got a tattoo it's um a rose and a poppy flower mixed together and it resembles my grandmother's so i did that yesterday and then one of my girlfriends had like a girl's spooky night we watched hocus pocus 2 had some wine so i didn't get back home till 11 30 and then by the time i took off my makeup got in bed i watched a little bit of netflix and went to bed probably at 12 30. <laughs> But yeah, I just woke up. This is my just wake up face. I need to put some skincare on and walk the dogs. And then I'm going to go to Trader Joe's. I'm so excited. I haven't been in probably a month. I need to stock up on some favorites, some essentials. And then also I want to pick up some fall things. I love, love, love their fall stuff at Trader Joe's. So definitely going to pick up a couple things. And then today I finally want to decorate for fall. I do live in an apartment. We don't really have visitors or guests over unless it's our parents. So I'm not going to go too crazy. I'm just going to put out a couple pumpkins here and there, put some fall candles. And yeah, that's going to be my fall decorations for the year. And then I just need to clean up my apartment. You know, the typical little messes here and there that accumulate throughout the weekend. So I'm going to put away some things, clean up a little bit. And then I have orange theory at 430. I'm not sure if I'm going to cook later, but we'll see. <laughs> so that is the vibes for today. So I'm going to go ahead and... Walk the dogs, put on some skincare, get dressed, and go to Trader Joe's. Also, I wanted to mention the last vlog I did. I mentioned Hurricane Ian, how it was coming to Orlando, it was coming to Florida in general, but it definitely hit Fort Myers, Naples, southwest of Florida very hard. So my heart goes out to all the families that lost literally everything, and they have to start all over again. People who lost their lives, like literally breaks my heart. These hurricanes are serious, and this is the first serious hurricane we've had in a really long time. So, it's very sad, and I'm super grateful that me and my family are okay. We made it through the storm. But there are some parts of Orlando and Kissimmee that got hit really, really hard. Um, Flooding-wise, flooding was very bad. So luckily, me and my families are okay. Also, thank you to some of you guys for reaching out to me on Instagram, asking me if we were okay. I really appreciate it. Thank you for thinking of us. So I'm going to go ahead and start my morning routine and then head to Trader Joe's. I'm going to apply a little morning skincare. I'm going to be using, of course, the Ordinary Hyaluronic Acid. I love this stuff. I just picked up the Niacinamide. This is supposed to help with pores and... And what is this supposed to do? It's supposed to help with pores and I think skin texture. So I'm going to go ahead and put these two on. I usually start with the Hyaluronic first. Put that all over a little bit. I did apply a little cell tanner on my face last night, so that's why my face looks a little extra tan. I'm gonna apply the nice set of my necks. Just apply a little bit. And my camera's about to die again, but I have a backup charger. And then I'm just going to use a little bit of this eye cream that I got from Dollar Tree, but my mom put me on this because one of the housewives from Beverly Hills talks about this, or the housewife from New York, she reads about this, and it's from Dollar Tree. So I'm going to put some moisturizer on. I'm still loving the one from Sephora, the All Day Hydrator. Also, Ryan is working from home today, so I'm going to be vlogging around him. All right, now to finish off this morning skincare, I'm going to apply some Tula Protect and Glow sunscreen. I just love the glow that this gives you. And that is it. I'm not going to jade roll this morning because I don't feel like my face is that puffy today. So I'm going to go ahead and walk the dogs. And it's a very beautiful fall morning here in Florida. <laughs>
Alrighty, we are off to Trader Joe's. I am so excited. Like I said, I haven't been in like a month, maybe even longer than that. So I'm going to stock up on some essentials and obviously get some fall stuff. Let me put my purse over here. I have a bad habit of driving with my purse on. It's not a cute habit. Okay, here we go. Yeah, I'm gonna get some fall stuff. I'm so excited. It's 10.42 a.m. It's sad how I have to get to Trader Joe's before 12 because then it's a hot mess. The parking's a hot mess. It's just crowded. I'm trying to get around the town. It's just very chaotic. So I'm gonna go now, beat the traffic, beat the rush hour, and then that way I can come back and clean up. I definitely wanna edit my YouTube video. I'm doing a empties video so I can edit that pretty quickly. So yeah, I'm super excited to go to Trader Joe's. We're gonna do that now. And we're gonna see what Trader Joe's wants me to buy. Can't wait. Also, I went to walk the dogs and the weather right now in Florida and Orlando, it's freaking amazing. It feels like fall. Like for other people, it's not fall, but it's 75 degrees, breezy. The trees were looking beautiful. So to me, it feels like fall. I spent a hundred bucks, which is pretty good for all the things I got. If I would have gone to Publix or Target, I probably would have spent a lot more. So in this bag, I have non-oat creamer brown sugar. I heard this is really good. Um, so I'm going to try it out with my coffee, with my Nespresso. Maybe it's like a shaken espresso type thing. I got two just in case. They're pretty small. Um, I got some feta cheese for my tuna rice bowls. And just for lunch, I'm going to make a salad. I got just one bottle of wine. It's the Coastal Cabernet Sauvignon. I heard really good things about Coastal. Catherine June from YouTube. She talks about the Coastal Sauvignon Blanc. Um, so I got the cap, so we'll try it out. I got some butternut squash mac and cheese bites. These look so good. Definitely not healthy or gluten free, but this will be a nice little Sunday fun day treat. Maybe to watch a football game. I got my favorite non-dairy um, chocolate coconut ice cream cones. These are not gluten-free, but this is a nice little sweet tooth for the end of the night. I'll just have one of them and then that's it. I got my favorite frozen jasmine rice. It's my favorite. I was tempted on buying another box, but my freezer is pretty small, so I don't have space for that. But love this, especially for my tuna rice bowls. It's like the best rice. And I always get the white rice. Brown rice is boring. I, I cave in and got some cheese. This is my favorite. It's seasonal, so I had to get it. It's the Toscano cheese dusted with cinnamon. So good. It has like cinnamon on the bottom, which sounds really weird, but so good with crackers and glass of wine. Definitely fall vibes. Even though I'm trying not to eat dairy, I had to get it. Um, I also got my favorite pasta sauce from Trudeau's, which is the three cheese sauce really good very it's only 2.99 so all right in this bag i have some more oats i'm running pretty low on the oats i have right now which is the same brand from Trader Joe's. super cheap get a big bag i got ryan some more ice cream cones and then i got myself some more vegan bonbons they're bon too for a late night snack i'll just have one of them I got some cream cheese for some bagel that I got. Again, I'm not trying to eat dairy, but I have to have cream cheese with bagel. I got more maple syrup to put in my oats and when I bake and stuff when I make little healthy gluten-free snacks. I got Ryan and I some immunity shots. I'm not sure what this one does. It says daily, daily value of vitamin C. Cherry juice color, naturally very. I don't, yeah, I don't know what this does to you, but I got it. Again, I heard another YouTuber talk about this, so I wanted to try it out. I got balsamic glaze. I have balsamic vinegar, and last week I tried to make balsamic chicken, 
but I think I needed balsamic glaze for that recipe so it came out very vinegary and Ryan was not a fan, I wasn't a fan. So I got balsamic glaze. I got some more black pepper. I love this version. It just makes it very crackly, if that makes sense. I also got some red pepper flakes to put in my salad and stuff. I got bananas for smoothies. This is really random. I got some pickles. Let's try one. I love these little miniature pickles. They're so good. Let's try it. Let's do a little taste test. Mmm. I love pickles. Love pickles. So good. And again, this would be cute with like some cheese, crackers, and some lime. I got vegan tzatziki dip. Last time I went to Trader Joe's, the cashier told me that this is like the best, the best, the vegan one. So I got it. I'm going to try it out. We do like to make a lot of Greek food here. So, or I should say I, because Ryan is a cook. I like to make a lot of um, Greek inspired um, bowls. I also got pumpkin cheesecake. I had to buy this now because this sells out so quick. And I like to bring this with me for Thanksgiving as dessert. So I'll just pop this in the freezer and this will be good until Thanksgiving. I already got Thanksgiving dessert. Yeah, it's because they sell out quick. So be frozen? Yeah, you just keep it in the freezer. Okay, in this last bag, um, quinoa and black bean infused tortilla chips. Some healthy tortilla chips that I like to eat with my tuna rice bowls or if I'm feeling like I want chips and salsa. I got two chomp beef sticks. These are so good. They're healthy and I just love these quick little protein snacks. I got some more olive oil. I'm running pretty low. I actually have, I'm actually using it as a tripod, but I'm running pretty low on the olive oil we have right now, so I have to get more. And the one from Trader Joe's is so good. It's only $5.99 for this entire bottle. I got two boxes of the gluten free pumpkin pancake mix. This is the best. I always like to buy backup because I still eat it throughout, like after the holidays. Um, and I love how it's gluten free. It's so good. I also got gluten-free pumpkin bagels. So that's why I bought the cream cheese so I can eat it with the bagel. I do have a vegan cream cheese, but I think with this bagel specifically, it will just taste way better with regular cream cheese. So I'll just take the L and eat the dairy. I got two little pumpkins, two little tiny cute little decorative pumpkins, maybe to put on the dinner table, or maybe to put on the kitchen table, but super cute. And then two lemons, I love lemons. And that is it. That is everything I got from Trader Joe's. Again, I got a lot of stuff and it was only 100 bucks, which is not that bad these days. If I would've gone to Publix, it would've been easily like $200. So I'm gonna put all this stuff away and then I'm going to clean up my apartment, put everything away, and then probably make lunch. I'm gonna make my famous rice tuna bowl. <laughs> it's Ryan's favorite. And then once I'm done eating lunch, I will probably edit my YouTube video. So that's the plan. Tuna bowl, so good. And some tortilla chips, healthy tortilla chips.
so good. All right, it is 1.55 p.m. and just finished lunch. It was so good. I definitely ate lunch a little later in the day, but... What? Life is so boring without Gatorade. Wow. So it is 1.55 p.m. now. I finished eating lunch. I did eat lunch pretty late, but last night, since we did like that girl's spooky night, we had pizza, cheese board, wine, so I woke up with no appetite. So I didn't have breakfast, so I had a little late. Sorry, I have like a piece of something in my mouth. So, yeah, I had a late lunch. Didn't have an appetite this morning. Anyways, I did decorate a little bit for fall. Oh, look who came. Look at Cookie Bear. Oh, it's my little baby boy. I love you so much. Did you come? Did you, did you come to say hi to mom? I love him so much, my baby. So like I was saying, I decorated a little bit for fall, nothing too crazy. I think I might go to Marshall's tomorrow after my nail appointment to get maybe some candles and just a couple more things, like some towels and a couple things for the bathroom. I don't have anything for the bathroom, but yeah, I'll show you guys later what it looks like, but that is the update. So it's going to be two o'clock. I'm going to edit my empties video for a solid hour before i go to orange theory i go to orange theory at 4 30 oh wait it's two o'clock so i only have two hours to edit yeah i'm gonna get it going i'm gonna edit i'm gonna bang it out hopefully today upload it and all and then that way i'll be ready to go for orange theory and then i'm not sure if i'm gonna cook later to be honest i don't know we'll see It is 3 o'clock. I'm still editing. I'm not even halfway through. I actually decided to edit my vlog. Oh god. Oh god, that was the ugliest yawn of life. I decided to edit my vlog first because I'm doing another vlog today. So I don't want to upload two vlogs back to back. I try my best to break it up. So I'm going to edit this vlog. And then the next video will be my empties video. And then it'll be this vlog. And then I also want to film my fall what's in my bag. Well, what's in my bag fall edition. Because I got a new work bag for work. And I'm obsessed. I have to show you guys. I have to show you guys my new bag. But yeah, I'm going to edit for another hour. And then head to Orange Theory. But I'm this close of falling asleep. I'm so tired. I wish I was Luke right now. All right, I'm about to head out to Orange Theory. I have my Sheen crop top with my Reebok sports bra on. And then I have my Lululemon biker shorts. Love these biker shorts. And I'm gonna put my shoes on and I'm gonna head out, take out my jewelry here, put some studs on and head out to Orange Theory. <laughs> All right, this is the finished dinner. It looks kind of boring, but it's really good. I added some of this vegan chickenless powder. Even though I have chicken in here, I just like the flavor of this. And it's like good ingredients. I don't like the stuff that comes in this packet because I just feel like it's just BS. 
Um, so yeah, I put some of this and then some red pepper flakes to give it a little spice, a little kick, and then obviously some salt. So really good. The brown rice, ramen, and the chicken. The chicken's actually really good. So I'm gonna go ahead and enjoy this. Once I'm done, I'll probably take a quick shower and then we have one of our shows at 8 p.m. So hopefully I can do it in time. It's 7.41 p.m. What are you crying? Why are you so petty? You already ate. You already ate.